Here we come to the elevator of the YMCA. here in Austin. Yes, I know. <laughs> Even mentioning it just would have brought the song to mind, so I decided to put it in there for you. Here we come. That's a Schumacher elevator. This is a small video because this is only a two level facility. This is the main floor which we were on and the basement which we're going to now. And the basement is open to the public. It says B. So here's the basement area. Notice the detector up there. System sensor 2400. It's used for elevator recall. And this ESL here is used for the door release. Now, surprisingly, there is no fire alarm system in this building. Just those two detectors. And there are two identical detectors on the main level. Identical to these. Now, the ESL that I showed you, which is used for door closure, and then the identical ESL upstairs replaced ESL 320s, which they installed when they built this addition, which was... I'd see in 1995 or so, and that's when this elevator was also put in. Now they replaced the detectors probably 2005-2006. Anyways, here's the detectors on the main floor just to show you that they are the same, except this one's mounted in the, the entryway to this building. Alright, I'm going to go back up. Main. Now let's focus on that. As you can see, it scrolls. I think it will scroll. I think it scrolls down too when we go to the basement. We'll find out. <laughs> I just saw it scrolled up when we got the main. So we'll just go back down again. <laughs> no, nope, it actually scrolls up again. Actually, I'll take you up the stairs. See, here's your pop machines and stuff. And there's the rec room. And there's your vending machines. So here's the stairway. Go up here. The main part of the also this wall it actually used to be an entrance until around mid late 90s probably when they put the addition in the y actually just has these they're just regular family guard detectors now they used to be smoke guard 8098s up until around 2000 but then i I gave these detectors to them. I bought them, I gave these to them, and they gave me the old ones. So, second part of this video will be a demo of one of the 809s. Actually, I changed my mind. The video a demo of the 809 will be a separate video, and I'll also compare it to the 800A. 